I absolutely hate people with ulterior motives. I hate people that judge you. I hate people that don't know you and fucking judge you. I fucking hate all these fucking people. My eyes are watering, so I'm just fixing that a little bit. And yes, I'm still sniffling, but it just really fucking sucks when people like judge you off of like things that like aren't even true they don't even take the time to get to know you like i hate that so much it's not good i don't like it i don't like when people do that shit don't fucking do it be a good fucking person be a respectable person and be a person of honor do the right fucking thing. If someone's good, let them be good. Don't fucking hate on the next person because you're never going to fucking prosper. You're never going to prosper. Um, All that. Like, I'm so sick and tired of people and their bullshit. That's what I'm tired of. People fucking bullshit because they're hating on you and they don't want to see you succeed. And when people want that, and when people try and stop your growth, you say, fuck them, and you keep it moving anyways. You do you anyways. Shit's going to fall into place. Like, this is not the first time I've seen this shit happen. I'm, I'm seasoned. I'm a seasoned adult. I'm a seasoned woman, baby. Like, <laughs> I'm seasoned. I know what the fuck I'm talking about. This is my fucking first rodeo. Let me get my cowboy boots and my cowboy hat and get the ride in this shit, period. Like, nobody's gonna stop me. Like, and I feel like I know something great is gonna happen for myself because too many people be trying to block my blessings. Like, what did I did to, what did I ever do to anybody for them to want to, like, fucking block my blessings. Like, bitch, what the fuck did I do to you? Nothing. Nothing. So we're just going to make this a video on what to do when people are fucking hating on you. You say fuck them. And you keep doing you. And you keep doing what God asks of you. And things are going to fall into place. And you have to believe in that. Like, if you want something to happen and it doesn't happen, you can't get mad and get sad and get in your feelings and start to be like, oh, this didn't happen because this, this, and this. Like, no, this didn't happen because God didn't want it to happen and you have to believe you have something better. And I believe, okay, I believe I have something better coming. And you guys are probably like, Sydney, what the fuck are you talking about? Because I just turned on this camera and started recording because I'm pissed off. And usually I would get sad and be in my feelings, but fuck that. The fuck I'm going to be sad for? A bitch still popping. I don't think you heard me. A bitch still popping. Okay, so it's like... <laughs> a bitch is just mad because they're raggedy. Like, okay, I'd be raggedy too. I'd be raggedy too. <laughs> That's why I'd be really mad. A bitch come in with her hair semi-done and a little bit of foundation on and a half-drawn eyebrow and bitches is hating. Like, wow, like, y'all should see me six out of the seven days. Like, this happens, like, one time out of the 30 days in a fucking month. And when it happened, y'all would have hate on me. But look, bitch, I'm raggedy too. I could have fit in with y'all little crew if you would have caught me on a Monday. You would have caught me on a Monday, I could have fit in. That's what you bitches don't know because you're just judging a bitch. Oh, you think she, she thinks she popping, she thinks she, bitch, no I don't. Like, you didn't even take the time to get to know me, bitch. Or you would have known, I'm a bum. I'm a fucking bum. I'm not a bum, a bitch got a job. But I mean, like, I be looking like raggy. Y'all see me, I post all the time looking raggy. Like, and it's just crazy that people really think this. Like, you don't even get to, This is how I know you don't take the time to get to know me, like, at all. That's just irritating. But I'm not going to let that shit get me down because the bitch is popping at the end of the day. I don't give a fuck. Nobody can stop what God already has going for me or you or anybody else. 
And that's the lesson. That's the tea, sis. Do you hear me though? That's the fucking. Also, I know I'm late to the party, but um, I just got this Urban Decay All Nighter Setting Spray earlier today. I had never tried it before. I was skeptical because my skin is oily, but this going on like eight hours. Besides a little pack at the beginning of this video, like eight fucking hours, bitch. Like what? <laughs> positive energy i'm on some kumbaya shit for real so i'm not even gonna be mad like i was really gonna get up my feelings but it's like for what like i know the type of person i am i'm a good person i'm a, good, a hard worker i'm a fucking hard ass worker and i'm genuine as fuck and nobody can take that away from me because i be letting people try and downplay me you cannot downplay me though no more like i'm not allowing it from myself, so I'm sure as fuck not gonna allow it from the next motherfucker, no matter who it is. And that's what people need to understand. I don't give a fuck. Like, if I'm setting myself to a certain standard, I expect certain shit out of myself, why would I let the next person downplay me? I'm not. I'm fucking not. Like, I used to, like, no, no, no. No, I said what I said. Let me run it back. I said what I said, and that's that. Like, <laughs> that's fucking that. It's gonna take the shit away from me. It is what it is. It's your girl, Sis Chanel. Welcome back to another fucking YouTube video. And if you're new here, what it do, boo? Honestly. Today's video, I'm just talking that real shit. And if you're in the real shit, then you're gonna watch this because people be trying to hate on you. This is how you sh and this is how you should respond to your haters. Fuck you, bitch. And I ain't covering up my tattoos no more for nobody.